we are going to make a retrofit response objects in this video. So we have two types of uh, requests that we are going to make in our app. So the first one is allowing the user to search uh, th for the popular movies that they have in the, uh, the movie DP API. And the second one is allowing the user to search for a specific, specific, uh, specific movie like Jack Reacher here and the query that we have created or by using the ID of the movie. Now, first of all, thanks for Retrofit for allowing the, uh, allowing the developers to model their own uh, re uh, response object. Let's go to the project here and open our movie app package and I will create a new package called response. Create package called response. And inside the response, we have to create the two classes that I told you. One for single movie request and the other for the movie searches. Cre create a new class and I will call it movie response. Inside this movie, I will make a comment that able uh, that allow you to make uh, to clarify if you uh, view the source code that available on the resources on the uh, Udemy so you can download them and see the uh, source codes if you have any questions. Now the first step is making is making uh, finding the movie object. First one finding finding the movie object we see we see here that the results the results inside the uh, the json result uh, the json request or response is stored inside the result array having these video these movies so json allow you to make uh, the, this uh, modeling for making the uh, objects and getting the response object. In order to uh, translate them into a written codes that the Java compiler will, will uh, understand, we need to use the serializing uh, object, a serializing uh, library that we have implemented, which is JSON. Now, so back to our postman, we see I have opened two uh, tabs, one for the postman for searching for popular movies and the other for searching for specific, uh, specific ID or specific movie ID. Guys, the first request here, when we are going to search for an ID or a single movie request, we get all data of this movie stored in, in an array Call of title results. So this is the results. I will copy it. Copy and in inside here, finding the movie object. I will make an annotation here. This class is for requesting or for single movie request. Okay, okay guys, this is for a single movie request. Finding the movie object started by making a serialized name, a notation serialized name, and it will call here a result. So I will paste it here. This is telling the retrofit that I'm going to serialize and deserialize the results of a, an, an array of title results inside my response and expose also do the same for the JSON that uh, JSON library that we have implemented. Now, private 
movie model and called movie and making public movie movie model and called get movie and returning here return move okay this is the singleton pattern that we have created for the retrofit and i will make a new uh, two string method implement it and in order to print the, the results for this class in the second type we have the results obtained for the popular movies that we have created or we have requested for, so the results also or the movies are stored also in the results array and having these uh, the details for every uh, movie now in order to create this class i will create a, 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 or sorry in order to understand this response we are going to create another uh, response class i will create here a new inside the response i will create a new java class and i will call it movie search or uh, movie uh, search yes search response okay i will close this and this movie i will make a comment this this class sorry this class is for getting multiple movies or movies movies list dash popular movies okay in the same way the first step finding the movie object then deserializing and deserializing the object i will start by serializing name serialized name also if you uh, as i told you it is the same it's a start by results so we are going to search the the compiler or the json are going to start uh, searching for the keyword called results results and start exposing it. it start exposing means that it is serializing and deserializing and what we are going to make private int this we see that the page number and the page uh, total pages are requested so we will start by getting the page and start by getting the results okay uh start i have created here sorry uh the results i will change it, it to um uh, let me check uh, the total results total results i will copy it here total results okay we can serialize and deserialize also the page the total pages uh, and the uh, total results but till now we will uh, change it later maybe but till now it's uh, good public and, and count or total or uh, total count underscore count and in the same way i'm going to serialize name called uh, results these are the results array and also serializing and deserializing expose method sorry and i will create a private since it is an array look guys it's it very important to understand this since it's an array here we need to make a list of of type of object movie model so this is a movie model and this is an object of a movie model and this is also a movie model and so on and th this is translated into codes by making a private list list of type movie model 
movie model and I will make it I will name it as movies okay public create the, const the constructor public in or sorry the the, moth, uh, the method the the, the singleton uh, pattern total count get co total count this is for returning the count total count and public public list of movie model get movies and deserializing it and return the movie movies the list of movies okay we need here some column now and also printing the results by using to string and here we go this is the response method or class that we are going to use for a search and getting multiple movies the movies list or the popular movies